Bloomington Police Department is filled with skilled, compassionate professionals. We have more than a 60 year history of protecting, serving, and partnering with our community. And it's that history that inspires our relentless pursuit of excellence. We have about 192,000 calls per year that we handle, both police and fire. We take medical calls too. We have 14 full-time dispatchers. I don't think we should yeah. take candy from strangers. What are you talking <laughs> No fraternizing with the police. When we hire new officers, we look for candidates who have compassion for people. We can teach them the skills and the professionalism, but compassion is a trait that we seek when we hire them. When we respond to calls, we're often dealing with people who are having the worst day of their lives. We realize how important it is to show compassion and to help them out in their time of need. One of the most important things I bring to the job of police officer every day are my people skills. Whether it be a tense crisis situation or just a day-to-day -day traffic stop, I want to be able to communicate effectively with them so we can come to a common understanding and solution. Bloomington Rock! Operating an emergency vehicle can be dangerous. We provide our officers with classroom and hands-on training. I came to the city of Bloomington for its reputation, for great training, and advancement opportunities. The demands of law enforcement today require officers to be in good physical condition, and we train them with the skills to defend themselves and others. It's a very professional department. It's a great place to be. I left another police department to come to the Bloomington Police Department for the opportunity, the training, and the challenge of going to a place I wasn't familiar with. We're at the band shell at Normandale Lake Park, and uh, there can be times when we'll have lots of thieves coming into this parking lot, busting out windows and taking purses and bags and things of valuables from these cars. Here we've got a real overt camera trailer, and there's nothing hidden about that. It's a great big sign to the world that Bloomington Police Department are watching this. But if we have some break-ins, now we can go back and see what plates came through. I currently investigate damage to properties, theft from autos, and financial transaction card frauds. We collect evidence at the scene, possible fingerprints or DNA evidence. I was a victim of a random drive-by assault. Through the latest technology and investigative work, the Bloomington Police Department were able to apprehend my attacker. Identity theft is the number one reported crime we have today that's reported to the Federal Trade Commission and is probably one of the most prolific crimes that we deal with here in the city of Bloomington. I've had the privilege of working with the Bloomington Police Department for the past 10 years. They've helped me provide a safe and wonderful community here in Bloomington for my residents. The Bloomington Police Department has one of four bomb squads in the state of Minnesota. They have state-of-the-art equipment to protect our community. Police search warrant! Search warrant! SWAT is called in when standard patrol tactics and equipment are not sufficient to handle a dangerous situation. The mall unit uh, makes about 25% of the arrests for Bloomington to maintain a safe environment for shoppers and guests that come to the mall. And we're able to do that because we work hard at, at building the relationships we have, whether it be with uh, loss prevention or, or tenants or mall security or the transit police. We have six canines. Four of them are assigned to the patrol division for apprehension and tracking as well as narcotics detection. The fifth dog is assigned to the investigative division for the sole purposes of drug detection. The sixth dog is assigned to the Mall of America as our bomb sniffer. Our holding facility has 13 cells and we book over 2,000 people per year. We provide a 10-week Citizens Academy. We cover topics such as use of force, DWI enforcement, and many others. Well, the Joint Community Police Partnership here in Bloomington helps to be able to connect our multicultural residents to our police department and to be able to form bonds of trust between those two. The biggest need that we have is making sure that our multicultural communities understand the police and that the police also understand our multicultural communities. At the core of our department you'll find a philosophy of forward thinking, one that calls on cutting edge tactics and technology along with close partnerships with our residents and businesses, always training and always looking for ways to improve what we do. That's the Bloomington way.